It is your boy, Jay Cozy. I'm bringing you a video live commentary. You know, it's 9.30 in the morning. I'm getting this up right early in the morning. I want you guys all to see it. It's March break. I know you guys are sleeping in. Um, just like I have been, you know, pretty much this whole year. Uh, you guys have been going to school, but yeah. Pretty much, guys, I'm going to be taking you right into a live commentary, a gun game. I'm going to be talking about COD Champs qualifiers. I'm going to be talking about people going MIA, two-week tournament that I set up, and the group state. So let's get right into COD Champs, guys. So COD Champs is right around the corner. It's on Saturday, March 26th. It's next week. COD Champs qualifiers. So I hope people are starting to get hype about that. We still don't have any teams set in stone, but we are going to be working on that. Um, we'll see how that goes. Um, we're going to go through the veto system, all that fun stuff, and just see if we can absolutely get like some team set in stone here because I know that I don't even know where my team's at. You see as in my header that I don't even know where my team's at. Or else my you know I you already know that I would be representing free gaming all day every day. You already know. If that was the team set in stone, you would know that. Like I would already have that set there. It would be definitely already say fruity gaming in my header. It would say it on my live streams. I'd be I'd be getting hype for fruity gaming. No lie. No fucking lie, dude. So yeah, that's what I mean by we don't know exactly where, the, like, we don't know where teams stand. Marco, not, I'm not sure what Marco thinks. I haven't talked to Marco in a while. But, and that's the problem. Pretty much, like, this group has gone, like, completely stale. Like, in the fact that we haven't been talking, and, that, and that's fine. But we're still talking about COD Champs real quickly. I'm not sure exactly where COD Champs is going to be yet. I'm hoping it's going to be at Iron Christian's house. I, haven't, I don't know that yet, though. They don't know that because uh, you know what? It's not my house to like g give out. It's not my house to set set up the event at. And it's not my. It's just not my house, so I can't just say like for sure if it's gonna be there or not. I'm not sure if they're not doing something that day. I can't say that for sure. So pretty much we're hoping that it will be there. If it's not, then it'll be at my house. We'll just chill here. We'll if it's six teams, de definitely expect two different like times time frames for you to be able to show up. They're, everything's gonna be live streamed. I can promise you that. Everything's gonna be live streamed with live commentary, and it's gonna be that's that's how I feel like it's gonna be. Yeah, it's gonna be a good time in that sense. I'll tell you that. So like, if we have two groups, uh, if we have two teams of, of, if we have six teams, and we're having like two groups, then it will be absolutely live streamed, and you guys will be able to tune in. I'll, through my channel, Janie Cozy, I'm gonna put it up for my viewers as well. They they're pretty pumped to watch it as well. Like, but I had a, like 23 viewers the other night, and they were they, the idea to them was like was good. So they're they're down to watch like you know me play, watch some some of the guys in the group play. You know, just some got some of the guys that I play with regularly in the in like the group in in Hendrix, my ladder team. They like they're down to they're down to watch that. So. We'll see exactly where it goes. Um, it definitely will be live stream though, and um, I, I hope everybody's looking forward to that because it's gonna be it's gonna be honestly such a fun weekend. It's gonna be such a fun day. Uh, everybody should be looking forward to it. Um, let's go right into uh, teams. So, like I said, we don't know where the teams are at. We're gonna go through the veto system soon. So I already went through that, and you know, there's there's that's that's pretty much what we have to look forward to there. Um, let's see. People go MIA. So I'm tr well. We've been trying to set up teams for a while, and it's kind of annoying that people are just like kind of not even talking in the group and not even letting us know whether they're playing at all. So when I'm tr when we're trying to figure out teams, if you if we mention your team, like give it a like or something. If we mention you in the teams, and we we don't know if you're playing, man. So just like people like Avi and Lenny, I'm putting you on blast. Like I haven't heard from you at all. I'm not gonna throw you on a team if I know that. And like. I know you guys aren't the types to like shout out at guys and say, "Yo, like hit me up, hit me up for a squad." Like you guys gotta let me know if I'm gonna put you on a team. Then I need to know if you guys are playing or not. So like I'm like I'm honestly fine with you guys playing, and not like not playing. I'm fine with you guys playing. It's up to, it's up to you guys to tell me if you're playing or not, so that I know. Pretty much, um, about to win this gun game right here. Smack in the face. No um, the the but yeah, so pretty much. That's where I'm at with that too. People are just completely going MIA. MIA. There's no way to practice to make teams if we don't know where you, what you're doing. Um, the two-week tournament that kind of went dry. I, I'm not sure what happened there. The, that one match just didn't end up happening. There's too many guys with conflicting schedules, and yeah, that pretty much just went to waste. I, we're gonna still try and finish it, but I'm not sure when it'll be done. When what's gonna happen exactly with that? Um, 
And somebody made a post about the group state. I honestly don't think that the group state is in any jeopardy at all. COD Champs is right around the corner. I think everything's going to get back up and going again. The Trash Hawk's going to be flying once the teams are made. And everybody's going to be enjoying it once again. Um, I think that the one of the biggest worries that's you, should, you might be going through is like, you know, the competition's going to be crazier this time, this time around. I, there's so much more better players coming to the next LAN that the, those teams are going to be so da more deep. And the, the practice, like, not, it's not going to be that much important, but there's going to be some good players, I think, that are not going to make it to the actual COD Champs event that will take place after, like, you know, after it's all said and done. It, it just won't be, there won't be, there's too much depth now that you might see a, a good long-time veteran like myself, Ryan, Sarek, Marco, you might see one of them sitting out of COD Champs, and that's crazy to think about. Um... So yeah, guys, I wouldn't be worried about the group state. I wouldn't be worried about COD Champs. I'm worried about making the teams. Next week is the event, and, you know, we talked about making teams way back. And you know what? We had it going, but it just didn't end up happening. So, um, like I said, guys, um, if you guys have any comments, you guys want to tell me any questions about COD Champs, leave it in the comments below. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed the video. If you enjoyed that ass whooping I put on, um, you know, let me know, guys. So pretty much that's all I, the, all for me, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um have a good day, guys. Honest to God. Have a good day. Leave a comment. Peace.